here we have the group with its very first activity after we'd been in, in operation for six months. It was offered to us that we tried Boccia, a short bowling game which uh, originally designed to help people with strokes, but we found that it works with dementia extremely well and uh, the group has become quite competitive. Uh, we have some little ones there helping us out on that occasion. But when you see the uh, person with dementia gets a smile on the face when the ball gets near the jack, been able to be carried on now for all the while that the group has been running. It's every Wednesday and we've been doing it now for approximately three years. Along with the other activities we go to the leisure centre and they indulge in the various activities that the instructor sets up per day. Uh, the badminton with the balloon is very well taken and uh, as far as the uh, hockey is concerned this starts to get very competitive, a bit dangerous as well. We'll target botcher in this case, using the same botcher balls to, to obtain connecting with the rings. Uh, then we get the hoopla. All these type of games have been designed to help the carer to have a little break, but not only that, it gives the person with dementia an incentive. They get lost in it and it gives them happiness in the time that they're actually doing it, which is the object of the exercise. We've got people playing cricket who have got dementia and I think it's wonderful to see the effect that it has on these people. Uh, we have to thank our instructor at the Leisure Centre for producing all these varieties of different activities. Uh, he's a young man called Dave Long. He does a wonderful job for the group. It's nice that we've got young people that are able to uh, help the people uh, that we're looking after to have uh, a comfortable life with dementia. Not the Olympic shot put us here. As you can see that we have a, a good variation of physical activities for these people to enjoy. Every time they achieve what they're aiming for, then of course you can see the smiles on their faces. Again, it's nearly a high five. Being our connection with Boccia, we eventually learned that it was introduced into the Paralympics. Once again we're on the badminton. This is a very favourite game with this balloon. And away from everybody.